Yo, what up guys? Welcome back to the Street Ghost YouTube channel. Today is an exciting day for me. I'm here with Aiden. Say what's up Aiden. Yo. Say what's up to the cam. Yo. Uh, today Aiden and I are just taking apart the R34 sedan behind me. Uh, we're getting ready for the turbo conversion, which is super exciting for me. I'm so keen to be making some doses. Um, but yeah, today's video is just going to be us ripping apart the engine and cleaning it up a bit, uh, getting it ready to put the turbo in. Alright, so we've got uh, quite a lot of stuff off the engine now, as you guys saw in that last little cinematic edit sort of thing, getting better at those. Let me know what you guys think of those, because I like them, and I'm sure you guys like watching them as well. But okay, so, so far we have coil pack and injector loom out, uh, and we're sorting all our stuff into Ziplocs, so we don't get mixed up. So we got injector stuff there, uh, we got the air intake off. And then this is our little rubbish box of things we're throwing out that we don't need. So we got the fuel rail out. Uh, and the injectors go in the back there. So I got new injectors to go in. Next I have been taking the uh, coil packs out and then cleaning each cylinder inside there if you guys can see. And Aiden's just been working on the cold side of the motor. Getting all rid of all the junk and taking off the intake manifold which we have over here sick so we're just taking everything we don't need off first and cleaning some stuff up so then when we put the turbo in it's fresh and ready to go what's the next stage Aiden? lock up all the lines for the turbo and just test with the turbo and stuff and also put in the new injectors and just fucking clean all the shit off everything it's feral under there, holy. Yep. Yo, we've got the manifold off now, uh, and we're just undoing the cam cover just to check the cam belt because it was replaced a while ago and it might need replacing, so we're just going to check that just in case. But it is lunchtime, so we're taking a break for a bit. Yeah, that's off, and we get ourselves some tacos. What do we got? What do we got? That looks yum. Yeah, sure. But yeah. 
we'll get back into it after lunch. So Aiden and I have just been looking at the cam belt uh, and it, when did the last day it got changed? Like seven years ago? 110,000 k's ago, seven years. So the last time it got changed was about 110,000 k's ago, which is too much. So uh, the belt doesn't look too bad, but it does look like it's old. But I think we're just going to replace it anyway while we have everything apart. And at the same time, replace that spidget uh, bearing piece because that needs to be replaced as well. So pretty much just getting all the annoying small jobs out of the way while we have stuff apart and hopefully we're still done the conversion within like three weeks okay so we're gonna take off the radiator the fan uh, and then that will reveal the cam cams and gears and pulleys and then we'll sort it out from there but uh, I'm just gonna start on drive shaft bolts while Aiden sorts out the wiring uh, so pretty much we've taken off the whole starter and alternator loom which is all this junk here and the knock sensors which is a mission and then so that's pretty much everything on this side off now just cleaned it up a bit and then on this side power steering's been pulled off the bracket and also the AC it's just well it should just be sitting there somewhere yep. and then pulled out the aircon heater lines so that's the last lines and there are a few little wires and shit and then that's pretty much everything apart from the engine mounts and the trans mounts because Chan took out the drive shaft already and the exhaust is over there. Yeah, so we've just decided to pull the whole motor uh, <laughs> because uh, yeah, it's looking like it needs some touch up work and we're pulling the trans off anyway to do that spidget so we might as well just take the motor off and clean it up at the same time. And check the clutch isn't too messed up. Yo, check the clutch. Yeah, this is going to be it for the dismantling video, part one of the turbo conversion. Uh, stay tuned for part two. We'll just be, yeah, cleaning the engine once it's out. Uh, maybe painting some stuff. Uh, mocking everything up, probably. Still in the turbo. Yeah, yeah bolt, bolt the turbo on and stuff like that. Stay tuned if you're interested in seeing how to turbo a Skyline RB25 debt. Uh, oh, D plus T. If you haven't seen our last video, someone crashed into me at drags. So we replaced my fender and also I painted my wing mirror, uh, wing mirrors to black. So go peep that up in the corner right there. We hit up Aiden's mate Alex. Shout out Alex if you're watching. Thanks for letting us use the engine crane. He let us borrow this engine crane for like a week. So we're pulling the engine out now, right here, everything's undone, coming out. So I'll chuck a quick time lapse for you guys just to end the video off. Uh, thanks for watching, catch you in the next episode.